Today we will be showing you how to assemble the Weeds 3D GoPro system. Start by removing the GoPro lid and battery. We connect the GoPro to a power bank so we don't need the battery or the standard lid. Replace the standard lid with a new lid which has a hole for the cable that runs to the power bank. Next, put the rubber case on the GoPro. Your GoPro is ready to go. You can use this cover to protect the lens in between uses. Now we need to assemble the monopod. First attach the power bank by screwing it onto the end of the monopod. Next attach the tablet mount. The mount comes disassembled, so you'll have to slide these tabs into place. Attach the mount to the monopod by unscrewing the mounting mechanism open and screwing it onto the monopod. Next we'll attach the shoulder strap. Both ends of the shoulder strap connect to straps on either end of the monopod. One end comes with a strap already and you can attach it like so. For the other end, we'll send you several options of straps and you can attach them like this. Once that's ready, we can connect the GoPro to the monopod. First, insert this adapter into the thinner end of the monopod. Now attach the mini ball head. And then the GoPro mount. To attach the GoPro mount, remove this screw. Be careful because this small piece comes out easily. Take your GoPro, pull up the tabs, and insert them into the GoPro mount. Push the screw through the mount and the GoPro and tighten. Here you can loosen the screws and move the GoPro mount in different directions. Loosen and tighten the monopod screws accordingly to lengthen all the way. Connect the USB-C to the GoPro camera and the USB-A to the power bank. Secure the cable with the zip ties. Lastly, mount the tablet. When putting on the monopod, adjust the strap so it's a comfortable length for you. Also keep in mind that you can change the position of the tablet. Your GoPro comes with a cleaning kit. It's important to keep your GoPro clean. We recommend using this to clean the lens to remove any particles and then use the cloth to finish cleaning the lens. Once you're done cleaning, use the GoPro cover to protect the lens when not in use.